I think like Thunder Gaming maybe. Like we that's this is a big pot. So shout out to Space Station. Yeah, we just had the Thunder Gaming event not too long ago. A lot of money was in that one. Uh, we had Ultimate 32, which was a 10k prize pool. Um, we had the box way back. That had a big prize yeah, pool as well. But did. man, I'm excited to see this match right here, man. We got Spargo, who's the number one in Wi-Fi right now, taking on Angel. And if you have not seen Angel, if any of you guys have not seen Angel, you guys are in for a treat. This is one of the best Robin players. And man, do they make Robin look absolutely sick. Oh, yeah, I'm really excited. I've heard Angel's really good. Uh, my main doubles partner, uh, Sakato, is a Robin main, and we do very well. And uh, a lot of people are like, oh, Robin's bad. I'm like, are they? Like, they're really not. Like, Robin has, like, top three, probably, ledge coverage in the game, tons of knockback, a lot of versatility. Like, I know the ground speed is lacking, but this character is pretty solid. Oh, yeah, not only is the character pretty solid, but, like, uh, like... The, 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 the projectiles are absolutely insane. Once you get the item play going into it too, like it's a whole nother character. Like that oh, Nair, yeah. they buffed that Ooh. Nair recently. Oh, but that Nair doesn't matter, man. We just gonna see a huge downer from Spargo. Uh, putting Angel right into the blast zone. Gonna see if Angel can answer back. 151 right now, taking a little bit of damage off of that limit break blade beam. Oh, oh no, Spargo. <laughs> oh, no air dodge, this is rough. Okay, good delay on Angel. That definitely would have been a stock if you got the uh, other part of that. Uh, up B, but yeah, as you're talking about that Nair, that Nair is like, oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, two dunks for the price of one so far. <laughs> Spargo looked at he said, I will show you who I am. Like, oh Ooh. man. And literally two dunks for the price of one, two stocks to, uh, to one in, in favor of Spargo. <laughs> it's not even who's doing bad, but sometimes you just get all bifurcated out of nowhere. You just die at 70, like... No, it's like you said, yeah. Like it's Angel's not playing bad, but it's just no. it's Spargo, dude. Spargo's an absolute monster. He actually just won the most recent juice box going all Roy. And I and he said, mm. and it's just like I don't know, he's just like, I think it was gonna have a secondary Roy. And then just wins a whole bracket doing it. <laughs> oh I, yeah, I'm not surprised about it. Like Spargo's the best uh, right now for a reason. Mm -hmm. Ooh, wow, went way oh, deep. Oh no! Angel, please! Angel had the right idea, but Mis-executing that Nair and Spargo was able to weave around it somehow. And this is, hey man, look, I love spikes and all three of your stocks are going away the way I choose. <laughs> Listen, I know we were just gassing up Robin. For the viewers at home, uh, what just happened was not Robin's fault. Spargo is just Spargo, okay? I don't want people to see that and be like, oh, Robin's bad. Because uh, it looked like that and you're not that wrong. But <laughs> that was a lot of Spargo just doing Spargo stuff. Uh, I don't even know if Angel really made it to triple digits on percent. Like, I know that was at 70, and the last talk was earlier than that. But, uh, yeah, that character's good. Spargo is just playing on fire. As he does. As he always does. You know, who's mm -hmm. surprised? And that's the crazy thing, too, is that those were three different spikes. <laughs> it's not yeah. like he spiked them the same way. It was, a, it was a down air to a forward air, and then the up special <laughs> for every single stock. That's like a stream challenge like somebody was like i'll give you ten dollars <laughs> if you land each version of cloud spikes in one match they said yeah bet. Uh, who, am I, who am i gonna do it against maybe the best robin yeah whatever cool. you, you know what? i would believe that that's almost true man i think spargo uh, is a fiend for money matches and just i mean we don't see spargo compete in a whole lot of tournaments but as soon as there's a big prize pool like this spargo just comes out of the woodwork and just says hey i'm at least taking uh first place so good luck taking oh, yeah. second. Oh, so on my saturday it's free we are we are in there getting paid all right, but hey, I don't know how I feel about coming back to Smashville, though. Um, I mean, I don't know how Angel feels about coming back to stage, because this is really hard. <laughs> For sure. I mean, hey, but finally finding a way back. Let's see if they can find a way to uh, abuse Cloud's, like, horrible recovery. Um, yeah. And see if, like, you know, because I just feel like there's so many options. I mean, maybe maybe Angel's not feeling it anymore, because the one time that Angel went way out there to close out a stock, uh, Spargo said... <laughs> <laughs> Spargo, with no regard for any life, including his own, just oh absolutely decimating Lord. Angel, man. I like how Spargo's like, I could recover. Or, eh, I'm going to put on the show. <laughs> but Angel's fired back with a ton of damage, 65% off so far. <sighs> and uh, I will say, I don't know how I feel about coming back to the stage, but Robin is very, very good on Smashville. That center platform makes it very easy to get those uh, arc fire ladders. And with oh, Leather Sword on top of it, you, you can really steal some stocks early. Um, and again, playing pretty well, mm -hmm. but it's hard to keep a lead against Spargo. 
Yeah, I mean, I guess it's just one of those unfortunate situations where you're just kind of like, hey, look, I know they just destroyed me on this stage, but I'd rather be on a stage where I'm comfortable and try to give some sort of, you know, competition than to just go through somewhere else and absolutely get decimated. But good stuff to Angel, actually. Nice little arc fire into the up smash there. Gonna be able to take the first lead um, in this whole set. Yes. Now, what I was about to say was that Angel's doing really good because Angel is staying on stage. Then Angel went off stage and took a bunch of damage. So Angel just has to stay center stage against Spargo because off stage, as we saw from all three of those spikes, uh, <laughs> is not the wave. Well, it seems like a. The center, he can do it. Yeah, it seems like a big problem so far is that Angel has been, like, not able to, like, slow down the tempo that Spargo's been setting the entire set mm -hmm. so far. Mm -hmm. And, like, it's really just Angel hasn't had a moment to breathe. Yeah, he. Ooh, oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, he just said, hey, read a book, man. <laughs> <laughs> you say, Yo, can you look at my homework real quick? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know who I am? Read up on me. So Angel's going to be able to take that game too, saying, hey, I'm not going to get showed up and will take a, a two-stock game of their own in one of the more Ooh. ridiculous ways I've seen in a while. That, that is funny. That is that is, <laughs> that is a hilarious way to take the game off Spartan. What happened? He can't read, man. He's illiterate. I gave, I gave him a book. He's like, ah, I don't want it. <laughs> he got hit four, which means the only thing he got hit by was that. He lost his oh. jump, buffered it down there. You know Cloud beat doing that for a while so mm -hmm. yeah that's true <laughs> <is> what it is <laughs> that make the, i don't know if i'm oh. made face right but you know something to that vein uh you wow what? So like, we're in the game three yeah i was actually like like i wasn't trying to write off angel because angel's super super talented but yeah. I, I was i was really expecting to go into this with a 2-0 from spargo and it's just because of like the momentum that spargo's had the past like year it's it's been yeah. a whole different level I'm scared to even do it. Let me let me just type it in. Because I didn't even bother typing him in the database. Because I was like, oh, I know he's won, I don't know, everything. Mm -hmm. But uh, let's, let's let's take a look here. First, 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 first. Like, <laughs> this is insane. Yeah. No, I think, like, I think the worst placement Spargo's had is, like, what, second or third? Like, that's it. Like, I, I don't is, think Spargo places anything lower. There is a Christmas lunchbox where he got ninth. And I'm going to assume that he was probably just like, I don't care. I got gifts in the morning. But other than that, <laughs> let's see. First, Dude, with the, first, first. With these first, brackets first, first, he's first. winning, it's probably like, listen, I got to wrap gifts because I've been bringing in the money, man. I got, <laughs> I got, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> he's, he's, oh dude, he's absolutely insane. Uh, look at this. Ultimate top, ultimate uh -oh. 32, $10,000 prize pool got fourth out of 1277 This kid is a monster. Mm -hmm. now, I'm, now, I'm not sleeping on Angel because I, I know this is the Robin to beat. But mm -hmm. uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see how this third game goes. I think Spargo okay. might... Swargo might have been goofing around a little bit. He might take this third game a little bit more uh, to heart. Because as we saw from that first off, he got that suicide side beat, you know, kind of for the flex, but he ended up losing the game. So, uh, right. the flex time might be over. Yeah, it might. Eat. I think you're right on that one. Uh, Angel, again, is definitely a player to take serious. Uh, if you're one of the top players in the Wi-Fi scene right now, uh, you should be familiar with Angel. You should be familiar with that this dude does not mess around, will delete your socks super fast. But Yeah, I'm, I'm even looking. He's got a fifth at a Get Clip 8. Oh, I was on that. He got fifth, or not that one. Fifth at Get Clip 8. He got first out of 492, second mm. out of 103, first out of 116. He's won a lot himself. You know, this is no slap. Oh, wow. Ooh, that, was, that was scary. That play. was real scary interesting stuff right there i think a lot of characters would have died in that situation well i think it's because he had the uh, the limit break uh, climb hazard that allowed him to live but uh angel was definitely looking for the uh elwin spike on that one just barely not getting that going uh but the, another another little interesting fact between these two is that uh history dictates that spargo is going to win this set uh they played against each other twice now mk uh, m coliseum number four and galaxy game at three both ending with spargo victories but angel has at least always taken a game and right here man angel's looking to rewrite history to say that hey look i might be <laughs> i might be losing more sets but i'm at least gonna try and take this one yo if angel wins this and upsets the whole bracket like that is that is rewriting history that is wandavision rewriting history right there no spoilers mm -hmm. boy that show's great um but uh Angel not in too bad of a spot. If he can get back to the stage, I know he can tack on a lot more damage, especially with this platform layout. Again, uh, Arcfire with like a short platform is just super good. Um, you see him very, very carefully picking his shots against Spargo. He's got Levensor, but he's not going in for it. He's throwing all these projectiles out. And you see Spargo really respecting it because he knows how fast that damage can uh, rack up. Mm -hmm. Really good right now. Uh-oh. Okay, well, we got a limit on deck here. Back throw, yep. 
Gonna be looking for the cross slash. Oh, the book coming back into play! Oh, he has to throw the, he has to throw the limit away. That's so unfortunate. I said Reed says Angel. Speaking of Reed, try to clean it up with that back air, as the cloud will do. Mm-hmm. There we go, man. But Angel, like it, it, honestly, the big difference, it seems like Angel just oh unfortunate, mm -hmm. but great stuff from Spargo di out of that. Yes, that is definitely a matchup experience right there, because that was a lost stock for a lot of people once again. Yeah, so uh, again, like it seems like Angel, like the big difference here is that Angel's been having the uh, the space and like the opportunity to really kind of get their own setups going. Uh, you know, they've been building up a lot of great damage, and Spargo's just kind of been struggling since then. Yeah, and I, I like that you see Levitor run out, and you see Angel immediately just go, all right, we're going straight to project. <gasps> no way. Oh, I thought that was going to be a stock right there. A lot of really, really close calls. Angel has to secure this before Spargo takes another early stop. Oh, nice stuff from Angel. Again, solid lead, only at 68%. This could be the biggest upset of the day if Angel's able to pull this off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, man. Uh, Angel's absolutely killing it. 82%. Got to see if they can get some good extra credit here right now. 96 to 10. But the thing is, it's crazy. Like, Spargo is on the final stock and not Angel here. Like, this this is crazy so far. This this will absolutely be the biggest upset of this bracket uh, should it happen. Yes, and as, as long as he keeps his lead, he's still in a position where Spargo can't get any of those suicide kills he was getting in that first game. Like, you know, he has to really take into account the fact that he's down a stock. He's on his winner's bracket stock right now. Ooh, yo, Spargo is going for the up smash right there, but Angel barely getting that grab Ooh. in time. Angel looking good. Angel looking really good. He doesn't have Levin Sword, but only a couple more seconds away before that's back online, and Spargo is in some real danger. Oh, yep. Getting through that shield. Oh, that could be able to get the final hit of the arc fire. But oh my god, the book Ooh, coming into read. play once again. <laughs> Going for a big read. I don't know if that's really the route you want to pick against Spargo. E oh, this yeah. is so scary. Yeah, Spargo's got to close out this stock soon. The dash attack probably going to do it. You know what? This game is absolutely 100% doable for Spargo. Angel's got to find a way to close this out and quickly. It is. Great way to respond from the Angel platform. Woo! Oh, just barely not getting oh! there. Do it. Oh my God! That's it. Angel upsets not only the one seed in the bracket, but the one seed on the internet. What an insane game from Angel. He played that so soundly. He truly just kept Spargo out of almost every situation he wanted to be in. He was right outside of range for most of those back airs. Those projectiles were on point. His his management with his items and Leventor was super good. Fantastic play to Angel. Yeah, man. Fantastic uh, dude, play. I thought like. After that game one, I thought it was just Spargo just saying, hey, man, just another another player in the way. I'll be moving on. But Shoot really what it up. turned into was Angel booting up, like figuring out what was going on with Spargo, the tempo that he had to match. And not only did he just match the tempo, but he also started manipulating it into his favor entirely. And Spargo just did not have an answer going forward. He, I mean, he, he played well, but Angel was in control the entirety of game two and three. Phenomenal yes. stuff 